hello everyone welcome back to tech genie in this video i will be explaining that how to fix no audio device installed no output devices found on windows 10 or windows 11. right now you can see if i go to my audio setting at the right hand corner it says no audio device is installed and if i click on it and if i try to adjust the volume increase or decrease the volume i am not able to use it and when i click on it it says no output device is found all right so what you have to do i will be sharing two or three simple steps that you need to apply and your problem will be 100 percent fixed all right the first thing that i would recommend you that you should click here on troubleshoot audio problem now in case if you do not find this option over here then you can also click on the search box and type troubleshoot from the suggestion click on troubleshoot settings click on other troubleshooters and here at the top you will find playing audio just click on run and now this will be detecting the problem that where exactly the problem is sometimes it automatically fix the problem as well and you can see one or more audio device service isn't running and it has been fixed so you can see now my audio device is available now i'm not getting that message anymore all right so this is the first thing that you have to do and i'm very sure that this first step only will fix your problem in case if this doesn't work for you then you have to close it right click on your windows icon then click on device manager from the list once the device manager comes up you have to look for audio inputs and outputs double click on it and then you have to look for the audio device here just right click on it click on update driver just make sure the drivers are up to date all right so you have to do the same for both of them or even if you get any other device you have to update them then you have to scroll down to the bottom and you see sound video and game controller double click on it and then here you will find high definition audio service or device right click on it choose update driver click search automatically for driver and if there are update available then kindly go ahead and update it all right last what you will have to do click on the search box type services open services app now here in the services you have to look for windows audio Okay, so you just have to look for Windows Audio once you get it. Double click on it. Make sure the startup type has been set to automatic from the drop down. And the service status is running. If not, then you have to click on start and make sure that the this service is running in the background. Then you have to click on apply and then click on OK. And check back if the issue has been fixed. And if not, then you have to restart your PC. And then you will find that your problem will be surely fixed. All right. That's all guys. Hopefully this solution will surely work for you. And if yes, do not forget to like and subscribe for any question. Uh, let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.